at least one gunman, possibly more. A shooting at the oldest Navy facility in the country, home to 15,000, including the Navy's top officer. And the Navy Yard is a very big place. It's very old. It's on the Anacosta River. And it was a regular Monday morning. And among those people steering into the Navy Yard was the shooter. So he went to the fourth floor. And on the fourth floor, he went to the restroom and he put his gun together. And that was 8.16 in the morning on a Monday morning. The Hope Dogs, Katie Lynn, Jet, were at our side again and, and just made the difference in the world. But the most consistent were the Hope Dogs. They came often, they came from eight states, and they came for two plus years. And I'm sure if they went back today, they'd be just as welcome as they were all of those times. But perhaps she is most well known for her first deployment and our first deployment. A month after we trained, a shooter went into the Washington Navy Yard and murdered several people. Katie Lynn, a survivor of cancer herself, deployed to the Navy Yard and gave comfort and encouragement to those survivors of the Navy Yard shooting. Um, I want to thank uh, Phil and all the folks from the War Dog Memorial who have made this possible. Hope has been an amazing organization to be a volunteer for. In the many deployments we have been on are countless to think of all of the children and the adults and the people that we run into. But there is nothing more exciting than going to a school that you know has had one of the most devastating things happen to them you are outside the school with two other teams and a bus pulls up with a load of kids and you know one person has seen a dog and it's whipped through that bus in every house. <sighs> there's a dog, there's a dog, there's a dog and window heads are all in the window. Look, because there's a dog at their school. You feel like you are just in Timberlake 10 times fold <laughs> because you are way cooler because you have brought a dog into their school. But the time to get